one thing that I'm taking away from this quantum leap experience is this idea that, you know, I think in, in my business, there's this idea of being number one, right? Like what is being number one on the call sheet? What does that mean? And I, and I know there was a lot of, like a lot of pressure going into this job, not only being the number one, but being an Asian American number one, uh, Asian American male number one. Um, so this, there was a lot of pressure going into it with mm -hmm. how I'm going to deal with it. And one thing that I can say that has proven to be effective and, uh, and I'd recommend this to anyone that would be going into a job or a place where there's a lot of pressure on them to perform. And a lot of people are going to be looking at you to perform. I'd say, be honest with the situation and be like, look, I I've never done this before, but I promise you that I will give it my all day in and day out. And I know there's going to be a learning curve, but just know that I'm going to be processing as I go and I'm going to remain as present as I possibly can. And you, we talked about willing things and there's a time and place for it, but to also know that if you can be honest with the people that are employing you to do this job and are trusting you with it, they will understand that honesty as being you being extremely earnest. And I think as Asian Americans, we're going to be put in situations where people are going to be trusting us with things that we've never done before, because that's just the state of where we are. Mm -hmm. So to be honest, with yourself and to be honest with the people who uh, expect a lot from you to say, I don't have all the answers, but I promise you, I will put a lot of my effort into the pursuit of finding those answers and working from that place really, really is a, a, a great humbling, but yet empowering place to work from. So that would be the one thing that I would leave people with 